All right, what's up, Hot Squad? This your man, Horse Hot Back here too. Welcome back to another Wicked Dolls Hot Banger reaction. So this one's going to be different. So like I said, I, I said before, I used to upload. I'm going to start dropping up to ten Hot Banger reactions. But look, there are so many trailers that dropped this week. I had to add them on the schedule, so which is crazy. So yes, Hot Squad, it's going to be more than ten trailers. No, more than ten. More than ten Hot Banger reactions. More than expected to be this week. So yes, Hot Squad. Uh, yeah. Because I want to get through this week, so I have to worry about it next week. So get over with. So, Hot Squad, we're going to start with the Hot Banger recaps. Today, we've got three Zephyr recaps, two Chajutsu recaps, and for the first time ever, I'm going to react to a Cosmo Not Verity Hour recap. So, if you see my schedule, you already know what I'm going to watch. So, Hot Squad, first things first, we're going to check out the Zephyr recap of Batman vs. Superman Dawn Justice. It's actually his recent one, and his recap title is called The Most Fraudulent Superhero Fight Ever. So, yeah, I, I've seen Batman vs. Superman Dawn Justice when it first came out in theaters, and I saw the extended version. I think it was the R-rated version, the, the Snyder Cut, I believe. It's not it's not named Snyder Cut, but really, it's like a, an unrated version. But it, movies, it's okay. It was all right when I first saw it, but I do kind of like the um, unrated version version much better the extended version i saw it on max years ago that was my first time seeing it so yeah uh overall i'm, I'm excited to see this recap see how how in the world how zephyr is going to create his hilarity in this one so hot squad without further ado we're going to jump right into zephyr's recap of batman vs superman don justice right now let's have some fun let's get straight to it it's about to go down So the scene starts and it begins with this amazing shot of Batman on the ground. Look at him, they gotta get the angles right. And it's immediately followed up with this shot of Superman in the air. Like, mm, the cameraman snapping right now. One thing about Snyder, that man can direct. We not even 10 seconds yeah. in and he fed me two wallpaper moments. He don't miss. Superman lands and Batman hits us with the corniest line I done ever heard. Well... Here I am. Man. <laughs> See, I expect such corny lines from Marvel, but DC, <laughs> not just any DC character, but Bruce Wayne. <laughs> not my goat, man. And my dog really hit the Mads Mickelson, the freezer post. Dare I say the drum buff? He really the thought this was cold. He's looking like this right now. Ain't you Nathaniel B? Nathaniel B? What is it? <laughs> Superman walks up trying to oppress Bruce and my dog is really walking back. Oh, I know some of y'all gonna think Batman's copping the plea here. He's not ready for smoke, but he's playing chess, not checkers. He's one of the biggest haters of all time. He was watching Superman enjoy life and he was like, nah, nah. that's not enough. <laughs> he's been plotting in the dark ever since. He's been waiting for this moment. Now is my time. <laughs> hey, that Nick. Superman keeps walking and Batman hit him with the. Ooh, got his ass. Did he hit him with a scream? <laughs> yep. And Batman, after getting Superman frozen straight slow up, got the cheesiest Disney villain smirk on his face. I can't even blame Brody. This is the happiest day of his life. He really went zero for four in death battle. He had to get his first W. Superman destroys the machines, and he starts to get a little tight. But even angry, he still tries to keep the peace. Look, I ain't trying to fight you, bro. What are you? Black. Protesting in Alabama. This Gotham. It was up once you landed, little bro. And at this point, if I was Superman, I'd be pissed off too. Bro, you don't understand. And I love this line delivery right here. I understand. Oh! oh I know that man's precious so. kicking right now. Ooh. With the way he was training for this fight, it really makes you wonder what hasn't he seen longer, a shower or his parents? Teeth looking like this and breath on hot, straight Taylor Swift. Back the fuck up, nigga! Got him flying across the scenery just like his op. And when he finally stopped sliding, I thought my eyes were deceived because no way bro's looking at me. He really needs any help he could get. He's really looking at the cameraman for some advice. Nope, don't look at me. I told you not to come out here in the first place. Nuh-uh, now look. Really started talking to the audience like, Hey kids, what can old bats do oh, nah. in this scenario? Pull out the chopper? Great idea! <laughs> Brought out the artillery and started spraying. But all the bullets did was treat him like a fat nigga glow or push him a few feet back. And he flies up to destroy it with his laser beams. And this scene really makes me think of what young Nudie said. Look what that money make a bid do. This man can fly, shoot lasers, and cannot take damage. Yep. And you really said, yeah, I can rock with him. Just because you on a Forbes list, nigga? I really hate niggas like this, bro. He's gonna try to ban for ban his way out of internal damnation. You're cooked. 
Superman walks in front of Batman again. Theatric as hell. He's really trying to match Thanos in theatrics. They're going pull up for pull up. He starts walking towards Batman, but hold on, rewind real quick, because this had me crying. Before so Superman's pull up, you see Batman heavy breathing and shivering. Yes. And what makes this crazy is my boy got 17 layers on. And my dog, there's a fire! This is not shivering over lower temperatures. Bro is fearing for his life. <laughs> Superman grabs him and throws him across the terrain. And this is where we get one of the scariest pull ups I've never seen. The moment Batman gets up, Superman is already behind him. This is straight horrifying. These are them horror game pull ups that make you quit the game on sight. I know Batman is fearing under that mask. And look at Superman. He's looking at this nigga furious. He launches him through the building and slams him into his own beacon and while batman's on the edge rethinking why he even came here superman is again talking smack you supposed to be a gangster though but you watching me from jail man you is a bitch and at this point <laughs> batman desperate as hell he whips out a smoke screen and throws it at superman's feet superman looking down this rock no way this man actually tried this zooms through the smoke and realize he got his ankles broke Got that man looking goofy, straight lost. Damn. Only for Damn. Batman to pull up behind him with a blick. <laughs> idiot. You're honestly an idiot. Batman shoots it in. Yeah, last try, little nigga. Oh. <laughs> Nigga got beam with the stench of muscle man. I know he's down there crying. <laughs> muscle man. Yeah, you like that? That's that little bit. You know it stinks. Breathe it in. That's fear. This man really talking about breathing in. That's fear. No, it's not, nigga. That's the plague. <laughs> Superman tries to throw a log, but when Batman blocks. No. Nope. You for, nigga? <laughs> My eyes deceive me? <laughs> Superman just starts throwing everything, and I can't even blame him. He has Damn. never been in a scenario where his attack's been deflected. And there's some scenarios you just cannot react to. Like, I remember when we was back in middle school and some nigga would randomly throw up. Like, yeah. bro, what do you do? And I'm thinking, even with just a little bit of gas, Superman can still hang in there. But nah, my man is getting straight dog. I'm mm. like, say you swear to God. Say you swear to God. And I know y'all see these 30 FPS combos this nigga's throwing out, bro. This ain't even fair. And that wrapped it up for me, bro. Prep time in Batman terms is just claw armor. That man lays him out and he jumps up ready to stomp him out like a big stepper. Nigga, boom. What? He gets Superman to the floor and look at my bands, bro. <laughs> you gonna cry, nigga? <laughs> he kicks him like he Vegeta and he's like, nah, look up when I'm speaking to you, nigga. Yeah, this Wayne, nigga, big Batman, big bees. That scene was so cold, I forgot I was supposed to be hating. Never mind, F that nigga. Batman hits a two-piece straight to his face and look at this frame. Hit him so hard you think it's a stunt double. He don't even look like the same nigga. And this is where mm -hmm. Batman really started saucing up. He hit him with a right left. Got him like almost a million. Choke and slam looking face to face at the wall like Ice Spice. Headbutt right into the hook. Mm -hmm. This is what really pissed me off about this nigga. He the worst hero of all time. Damn. He's really violating like this against a civilian savior. But God forbid a nigga put his hands on the Joker. <laughs> you better stop. 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 <laughs> See how warped the superhero agendas be? It's just like Black Panther. Killmonger said, yo, we should try to save black people. But Superman's on the floor and he comes into a realization. <laughs> oh my god! Blocks Batman's kick and throws him like a rag doll. And this is when I knew my Kryptonian crash out was really back. I don't know how he turned Batman into a goldfish cutout on the wall. How you contorted a nigga's body to come out like this? I could not explain even if I tried. They run at each other like it's WWE and Batman hits a Bingo. I says Bingo. <laughs> To the wall and batman starts hammering it with blows until it just stopped working and yeah. superman even gave him the look it was over from yeah. there <laughs> and just like when shoddy's texts go from hey to <clears throat> after two yes. weeks a free trial is over and even batman knew this and this scene right here is just hilarious we seen this whole fight batman put in the beats on superman but the moment he gets his strength back look at him <laughs> Like, nah, I'm crying. He's really looking like that one speed fan. Please, Superman, I need this. My mom is kind of dead. What? Superman dumps him to the floor, and before Batman can even recover, he launches him through 20 whole stalls. 
God damn, damn right? And while he's on Shoot. the floor, Batman tries to reload his gas as fast as possible. But Shoot. at the same time, Superman's in the corner of the room losing his sanity. And I heard Superman hit this screen. I was like, nah, it's over, dog. He sprints at him with the Markiplier form yes. only to get shot in the chest. But Clark Kent was raised on a farm. He knows how to put animals to rest. He hits a lick off Batman's mask before he knocks out. They both on the floor fighting excruciating pain, but Batman's way worse than Superman. My boy over there looking like he fighting off straight perks and ass. We geek hard? Nah, we geek atrocious, nigga. Look at my mans. Man, man, man. Oh, man. My brother is lost. Like, nah, this is crazy. I seen a homeless nigga off fat and he was fiending the same way. This ain't a joke, nigga. He's on his last legs. And while Superman's on the floor tweaking, he looks up to see Batman holding a whole sink. Like, bro, that's why I hate this nigga. He stay dragging it. Why is my boy's esophagus connected to his kneecap just because he jaywalked? He crashes it on his cranium, knocking Superman out. And just like the African niggas with the casket, started killing. Carrying Superman to his grave, throwing them to the bottom Damn. of the building. And in these moments of the fight, it really just shows that Batman's a traumatized child that doesn't have parents, bro. You let a nigga outside one time in the year. Why are you using Superman's body like you in the Olympics, <laughs> nigga? You already won! Take the dub and leave! Like, it's so crazy. You ask this nigga to do this to any of the villains in Gotham? Fuck no, baby. <laughs> and while Superman's on the floor ready to face defeat, Batman and grabs the Kryptonian spear ready to take him out. And now I see why Superman was on go when he saw him in Justice League. The reason he's trying to kill him makes no sense. Batman, hmm. why are you doing this? You are a good person, nigga. <laughs> like my nigga. What? But here is where we get the infamous Maria song. Yep. And like everybody, I think it's trash. I've seen some videos on Snyder's true intention with this scene, with the name making Batman realize Superman isn't some unfeeling, emotionless deity, but actually a regular human being. Like, I see the vision, but the execution is just horrible, bro. And the scene ends with the mid lowest lane coming in her safe. Mid lowest lane. And Batman dropping the spear. I had to get the DC Civil War out the way, and now we about to get to the real one. I'ma see y'all next time. All right. Wait, did, did he just say mid lowest lane? <laughs> I hope he's joking, man. I hope he's joking about that because Amy Adams, whoo, Amy Adams is one of the greatest, greatest actors of all time. But yeah, um, this is a great recap. This is a hilarious recap. Not gonna lie, but yeah, that whole Mark the Lion. Why'd you say that name? I was like, okay. I was like, okay. It's kind of, kind of getting off the rails here. But overall, yeah, I, I this is a great recap. <laughs> great recap, man. Absolutely great recap. W recap Zephyr. Absolutely. So Hot Squad. That is my conclusion of my Batman versus Superman Dawn Justice recap. By Zephyr. So if you enjoyed this, please hit that button, comment, share your thoughts. How many times have you seen Batman vs. Superman? Um, do you think it's, it's um, definitely must have rewatched? Have you seen the array version? So yeah, overall, really great, great, great recap of Zephyr. Keep up the great work. So Hot Squad, I have another Zephyr recap, and this is Drake vs. Kendrick Lamar recap. So I'm so excited to see that one. So Hot Squad, please stay tuned for that.